I Did you know that it. this happened? Do you know this happened because of Iran? Yeah. The, ex- the export, the ex- Wahhabism was exported out of Saudi Arabia after 1979 in response to the 1979 Islamic Revolution in Iran and the siege of Kaaba. The siege of Kaaba happened by Wahhabis in Mecca in response to the Islamic Revolution that happened in Iran as well because it emboldened a lot of Muslims around the world to stand up against pro-American monarchies. And back before 1979 in Saudi Arabia, Saudi Arabia was moving Western and Wahhabis were being ignored. And after the siege of Kaaba, um, the Saudis decided to go back and take the Wahhabis very seriously and everything became a lot more Islamic. Before 1979, you even had reporters without hijab giving you the news in Saudi Arabia, right? But everything became Sharia all over because of what because the Iranian revolution brought Sharia back up in Saudi Arabia and also because of the exporting of revolutionary values, the Shia, Velayat Farih version of Shia Islam from Iran um, outside of Iran's borders Iranian proxies being spread all across the Middle East, that made Saudi Saudis panic because Iran had an eye for Saudi land, especially the oil-rich Shia part of Saudi Arabia. And the Saudis were um, very, always extremely terrified about Iran's motivations within their borders. So they started doing what Iran was doing. Iran was building many infrastructure outside of its borders trying to spread its ideology and Saudi Arabia responded by building madrasas all around the world spreading Wahhabism. Uh, this is why if you look at, for example, uh, Pakistan, you could see the madrasas, the number of madrasas just p- like uh, takes exponentially grows right after 1979 because uh, that's when Saudi Arabia decided to build madrasas in Pakistan. Like before 1979, most people in Pakistan didn't even know what's the difference between the Shia and Sunni. But now they're like fighting over it with each other, right? This is because of Wahhabism growing everywhere, like Saudi Arabia growing it, you know, exporting it to Pakistan, Afghanistan, Indonesia, and Malaysia, and it's making all those all of these places worse for it. But all of this happened because of what happened in Iran.